Are you tired of scrolling down your TikTok feed and only seeing iOS 14 aesthetic posts and not knowing how to create them? Let's see what's on TikTok today, man. Let's see what's on TikTok today, man. Hey guys, so I'm going to show you how I made my square icon covers. Are you sick and tired of being treated like you're nothing just because you don't have a drippy iOS 14 home screen? You, you heard about the new iOS 14 update? Yeah, everybody heard of it. Let me see. Let me see. What? Uh, well, um... Let me see yours. Chill, chill, chill. You don't. Let me see. It's not even. It's it's so. It's like cool. It's like decent. This is basic. Get out. Wait, what? you said you said get out. Wait, what's? Yeah, what? it's that. This sucks. Why? What? It's bad. It's. Change it. Are you embarrassed to even ask your friends to hang out anymore because your home screen is just not drippy enough to be around you? <laughs> Yo, what's good, bro? What's good, man? Yeah, you trying to you trying to like go somewhere today or like do something? Sure. Wait, 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 bro. Do you got iOS fourteen? I guess. Yeah, yeah. I downloaded it, but like the I don't like have like a cool home screen or nothing, cause like I don't know how to do it. Yeah. Uh. Never mind, bro. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Official Corey, the one and only Corey, and the best Corey out, man. And y'all already know, I'm back with another video, man. So look, I know why you clicked on the video. Y'all want a drippy home screen so y'all can show off on TikTok, show off to your friends, show off to your parents, your grandparents, your dad, mom, sister, brother, cousin, auntie, dog, puppy, whatever, man. We don't, we don't bang with cats over here, no sir. But look, man, y'all, y'all want to show off, y'all want the drippy little aesthetic, whatever, screen. I understand that. I, I definitely understand that. But look, man, we're not going to do any of that until you guys hit the subscribe button, turn the post notification bell on, and hit the thumbs up before you even get into this video, man. I'm going to bring you guys the simple, easy tutorial on how to get the drippy aesthetic home screen, lock screen, background, whatever you want to call it, man. We're about to, I'm, I'm about to show you how to do that right now. But look, like the video, man. Let's get this video to at least like 30 likes, man. I'm doing you guys a big favor. But look, man, we're, we're going to get straight into this tutorial, man. I don't want to waste any more of your time, man. Let's get straight into that thing. Let's get it. So basically, man, basically, man, basically. Let me get a screen recording up. All right, guys. So basically, first thing, first, first thing, first. You need to go to your wallpaper and, and choose a color you want. Like if you want purple, black white whatever you want choose a color you want i'm gonna go with white because i have an idea i seen an inspiration of what i want to create my life so look i'm gonna set it as white as your home screen don't set it as your live screen set your home screen as white so as you can see right here probably yeah, like right there you can see all of my stuff is white the background is white and that's just the start to what you need to do boom perfect all right guys so look next thing you do next thing you want to do after you change your color of your wall after you change the color of your wallpaper home screen whatever you want to call it we want to go into the app store and you want to search up the app called widget smith it's called widget smith you want to get that downloaded blah 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 i already have it because 
I'm a genius. So yeah, you search that up, download that. Boom. After you download that, I already have a few apps in a little group because that's the color section that I'm gonna have in my wallpaper area. So next, what you wanna do is open up Widget Smith. I can show you guys, so as you can see right here, I don't know why I'm showing you my screen. I have a calendar and a date, blah, blah, blah. So that is a generic widget. We're gonna cancel that. That is a medium generic widget. The way you add one of those is add widget. And you it, it'll start off as default a calendar. You could choose whatever you want, boom, 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 customize it however you want, whatever. But then after you save that, boom, you save it. You hold down on your home screen is a plus button in the top left corner. If you scroll all the way down or search widgets, press widget smith and look at your medium ones, you'll have one of those. And then yeah, you could just add it, press done in the top right corner, boom, you have a little calendar. But look, I know you guys want the drippy aesthetic one, so I'm about to show you how to do that one. So, what you wanna do, go back into Widget Smith. I'm gonna delete the ones that I already have made. Boom, 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 boom. Delete these. So look, first things first, I'm gonna add the large widget because that's the biggest one. So as you can see, they pull up a calendar, you click on that. Click on the default widget, then if you scroll down, you'll see photo style. Click on photo style. We're gonna press on selected photo at the bottom of the screen. Press choose photo. And then you should press your photo that, that, that you want in there and put it in there. So I put this little green one because I'm gonna color code it. And then we're gonna boom, we're gonna, we're gonna leave the app. We're gonna leave Widget Smith. Hold down again, go back to the top left and you'll see Scroll down, tap down to Widget Smith or search it like I said earlier. Press add widget, press done. And then if it doesn't pop up, just hold down on the widget, press edit widget, and select the one that you just created. Which is this. Boom, 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 boom. I'm already dripping. I'm already getting invited to the mall. I'm already getting invited to your girl's house. So look, next, if you want the little small widgets, I can show you how to do that too. So we're gonna do that, we're gonna open it up, boom, small widget. It's basically the same exact thing as I just did. Uh, scroll down, you go to photos, selected photos, choose photo, 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 blah, 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 you get it. And we're gonna click on this picture that I want, save, boom, hold down on that. Boom, boom. And like I said, you're gonna be creating multiple widgets. So it's not always gonna choose one for you because you're gonna have a list of them. So that's why you hold down on the widget that doesn't have anything, or if it already has a preset one, just hold down and select the one that you just made, press small, boom, and it should change into the thing. So you can rearrange it however you want. The way I'm gonna do it, slide these down there like that, and look at it, it just looks nice, doesn't it? Boom, and you have like your little, your colors, all that, and then you can go into the next page, the way you create another page, hold down on the screen, because I have plenty more apps, and just select the little, it, it should be a check mark. If your color is not white, it should be a check mark at the bottom. Hold that, press on one of those, and it pulls up another home screen where you can create another one, like so. But, you guys are probably wondering, I've seen on TikTok, people had icons, small icons, and they click on those, and it takes them to the app, but it doesn't look like the app. I'm gonna show you what I, I'm gonna show you how to do that too, man. I'm, I'm, I'm giving y'all a little bit of sauce that y'all gonna get invited to all that, man. Y'all gonna stop getting treated bad. Y'all gonna stop getting roasted. When y'all scroll down TikTok, you guys are gonna be able to show off your little drippy aesthetic home screen, man. So let's get straight into that next one, man. Let's get it. All right, guys. So look, before you guys go get creative, blah, 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 I'm about to show you guys how to make one of your apps actually turn into a picture that you want. So let me get the screen recording up. All right, so look. Next thing, it's not on Widget Smith that you have to do this one. So you have to search up shortcuts. Once you search up shortcuts, you wanna press the plus button in the top right corner. Press add action, right? Type in the search bar, open app, and press the first one that you see. Okay, so it's gonna say choose. So you have to choose from a few apps that you wanna, whatever app you wanna open. So for example, I'm gonna do Cash App since I already have the green little aesthetic or whatever you wanna. So, 
Next thing you want to do is press the three dots in the little top right corner. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then once you do that, add to home screen. And once you press add to home screen, it gives you a few options. So a few options, if you press on the little stack icon and press choose photo, it'll let you do the same thing that you were doing earlier. So for example, I'm going to put in a little green blank and I'm going to title it money 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 sign app I'm gonna just title it money money sign all right so it's money 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 sign and it added to home screen so when you exit the app it should be over there and then that's when you can edit your home screen and move it in like so as you can see so look there, there we go but the only downfall to that, man, when you click on the app, it's going to take you to a whole shortcut and then take you to that. It's like a 0.5 little second in between the apps. But look, as an honorable mention, if you go to the app store and you see this app called Color Widgets, if you want to change your calendar up a little differently that would have preset colors and stuff, you can download that as well. I heard about that app, Color Widgets. But yeah, man, that right there is how you create the cool little ios 14 background stop being so plain stop using all the default ones that are already on your phone stop using the default ones already on your phone you can get creative you can get use your brain man use your head go go explore find some pictures some stuff you like man and go figure it out but look man that is all for this video man i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope you, i taught you guys how to do it i hope you learned something if you have any questions you can leave them in the comments down below i should be able to answer them i'm a pretty i'm a pretty smart guy i had a 4.8 GPA, you feel me? But look, man, if you guys didn't subscribe already in the beginning of the video, man, make sure you guys do so now. Hit the like button before you guys leave. Turn the post notification bell on. But I'm gonna be back with more content, more reaction, more bangers. But that's all I got for you guys, man. I'm out.